Hey guys, this is Echo Soundworks, and you are checking out a machine quick tip tutorial video for ADSR. In this video, I'm going to show you my preferred method of exporting and getting your stems, whether it's on a cell level or a group level, outside a machine back into your DIW for mixing. There's a few reasons why I personally like to do this. First, I don't have to muck about with the multi timbral output. I don't have to set up a bunch of aux tracks in Logic. I don't have to assign a bunch of channels in Machines Mixer to coincide and correlate with the aux tracks in Logic. I literally can just take the audio out of Machine back into the DAW and I can mix it. Now, the second reason why I like to do this because it's a little, it seems like for my workflow, it's a little less of a hassle. But the other reason I like to do this is I like printing stuff to audio. Because if I have the MIDI or if I have the availability to change the hi-hat pattern or the kick pattern, I will do that every time I open the session or I will go back and edit it more than I need to. So once I print it to audio, in my mind, my workflow, I'm kind of like, okay, this is pretty much done. It's printed. Now I'm just going to do the mixing. I'm going to add things like EQ, clean the sound up, compress, stereo imaging, all that sort of stuff. I know you can mix inside of machine, but I know a lot of producers, myself included, do like to get the drums out of machine and work back into the DAW. It also saves processing power to be on audio tracks. So let's look at how we can do that. So all you have to do is go to the little drop down arrow, arrow up the very top of your machine, go to File, go to Export Audio. Now, by default, your options may be on 16 bit. You want to change that to 24 bit, and it will most likely be on master output. Now you can do group outputs. Let's say you have different groups and you have different scenes that will output the different groups and scenes. Or you can do sound outputs, which is what I'm going to do for this video. Now you can move this window around so you can see everything in machine. So I don't have the OVO chop, the OVO vox chop on. So let's just turn that off. You see that cell is not illuminated. We also don't have the conga here. So let's turn off and these instruments, let's turn these off so it doesn't give us blank tracks. And we'll turn off the conga. So now what we're going to do is we're going to choose our folder destination and I will do a new folder and we can just pop it into anywhere we like. You can put it desktop, anywhere that makes sense for you. I'm going to do machine tut. We'll do two machine tut two and we'll hit create and then I'll hit choose and now I'll hit export. And the export is quite quick as you can see. So we'll hit close. We'll turn off machine. So now we have just the instrumental. All right, let's get the drums back into it. So I'm going to go to my spotlight. I'm going to type in machine, machine tut two. We're going to open this folder here. And now we have the files. So you could do a bulk drag and drop, or you could do it in an order that you want. So for instance, I can take, let's get both of my kicks. We'll pop that into here. We'll do create new tracks. Let's go back to finder, pull that open. So then we can do the snares. Or you could just do a batch one, doesn't matter, but we'll drag and drop these in. We'll hit create new tracks again. And again, you can do this however makes the most sense to you in your workflow. But for me, this is just a lot easier than doing the multi multi timbre out. So let's get the let's get the open open hi hats in there now. And we'll pretty much be done. Let's do this one. We'll get the perk in there as well. So there are 11 files there. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I'm missing one, but we'll call it a day. So let's. we have the kicks here. We have our snares here. We have the clap and hi-hats there. So let's listen to this. All right, for me, that's just personally a lot easier. So there's a lot of cool stuff you can do with this, guys. Check it out if you haven't. Ec file, export audio, sound outputs, master output, and group. So see how group output right now, it's OVO kit six. You can do different groups. So if maybe certain sounds are coming from certain groups, you can do that. If you guys have any questions or comments, let me know below, and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Like I said at the beginning of the video, my name's Echo Sowers. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.